Today I'm going to show you how to add a banner across the top of your Jira so that you can create messages to share with your Jira users. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing to the channel, drop a like if you get value out of this video, and if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, let me know in the comment section below. Also, if you want to help support the channel, please do smash that like button as that really does help the channel grow. Also, make sure that you share this video with your coworkers, with your teammates, colleagues, bosses, anybody that you know that uses Jira on a daily basis and they can benefit from these types of videos, let them know about this channel so that they can subscribe and also get all this awesome content. Let's jump into today's video. So for today, we're gonna come into Jira and we're gonna add a banner. And this banner is gonna be added here on the top section of your Jira project. Now, why would you wanna add a banner? Well, there's a lot of reasons why you would wanna do it, but a couple that come to mind are, if you're gonna make changes that are gonna impact all your users, by creating a banner, you basically ensure that every user is gonna see it. If you're gonna change policies, you're gonna change a configuration, something that's gonna be global. You don't wanna do this if you're gonna impact only a few people because everybody, everybody that logs into Jira is going to see this banner. So you wanna use this banner strategically. You don't want to make it a nuance where folks are not going to be very happy with this quote unquote spam. So make sure that you have a very good and valid reason and whatever that reason is, it's up to you and your discretion. But I'm going to show you how to add this banner. I think it's really beneficial to be able to make an announcement, kind of like a blast, so that anybody who needs to see this message, which is going to be all your users, will be able to easily see the message. And I'm going to show you some of the configurations. So you do need to be a Jira administrator in order to do this. And what you're going to have to do first is you're going to click on the gear on the top right corner, and then we're going to select system. Once you're there on the left hand side, we are looking for announcement banner. If you don't have that, you're probably not in the right version of Jira. This is for Jira cloud. So make sure that you check your version of Jira. Once you're here, you're going to be able to edit your announcement banner. Within the announcement, this is where you're going to be right whatever you want. I recommend that again, you use this very strategically. Use this when you need to communicate something very, very important to your users. Like maybe a big change is coming or you're going to remove an entire status or something, right? It could really be anything you want, but just keep in mind that everybody's going to see it. So you want to make sure that the message is appropriate. Now, because I'm a team of one, I'm going to have a little fun with this and I'm going to do a little shameless plug for the channel. So if you haven't subscribed by now, please do make sure you hit that subscribe button right now. But as a gentle reminder, as a very passive reminder for anybody and everybody that watches these videos going forward, I'm just going to low key add a please consider or just, I'll, I won't even be so formal. Subscribe to Ape Tech Tech Tutorials and drop a like on this video okay so i'm just gonna make a very low key subscribe to the channel drop a like if you haven't already again this is going to be something that's going to be very dominant it's going to be visible in all the pages so as a little added bonus for future videos you'll be able to see this banner in all the videos so now i don't have to remind everybody to smash that like button okay now once you have your message and whatever message you want you will have a couple of options this banner is shown to users this is what basically toggles the banner on or off. So just by writing the message and clicking save, that's not actually going to do anything. We need to enable the banner to show up. And that's what that first slider is for. So I'm going to go ahead and turn on this slider. Now, the next option that you have here is users can dismiss the banner. Now, this one is up to you and your discretion. Basically, what this means is when a user comes to Jira, they're going to be greeted with a nice banner with whatever lovely message you put up there. But it's always going to be there unless you select that second slider. If you enable that second slider, the users, when they come in, they'll have like a little X and they can dismiss it so it can go away. Now, I want my banner to always be there. So I'm going to not enable this option. But if you want your users to basically just get a confirmation, they'll read the message. They can hide it. That way it doesn't annoy them. This is that option that you have available there. Now, the next one is the visibility level. This one I can leave as private because for my policy and hopefully your policy as well, your Jira is private to just you and your team. 
you don't want your Jira to be, generally, you don't want your Jira to be open to the internet because, let's face it, most of the time we're having some co- sort of confidential information that we just don't want our competitors or anybody off the internet to know. So for the most part, you're going to be okay with leaving the default setting of private here because hopefully if your, my fingers are crossed for you that your Jira isn't exposed to the whole internet because, again, okay, that could lead to some conflicts down the road. So I'm going to leave private, but for whatever reason, if you did have a externally facing Jira, Atlassian has an externally facing Jira, so they might want to make an announcement to the world. So it's up to you and your specific configuration, but do check your cybersecurity policies and other data privacy policies just to make sure you're not in any violation because this would be a great time to go double check your Jira to make sure that it isn't indeed publicly facing. But I'm going to assume that it is private and that you only want the logged in users, the folks that you're paying a license for. And so once you got that set, all you're going to do at this point is click save. And once you click save, as you can see, the banner is there. Now, I don't think there's a way to change the color or the position of this banner, but you can see that it is right there at the top, ready and available. Everybody that comes to it is going to see it. Mine says subscribe to ATEC Tech Tutorials. Drop a like on this video. So if you haven't done either or, now's your opportunity to do that. And I did not enable the feature to dismiss it. So this is going to always be here every time I log in. And so this is, again, a, a setting that you're going to want to consider and think about before you implement it. So that's pretty much it. What do you think of this functionality? Are you going to enable an announcement banner? I didn't really know that there were announcements banner available. I think this is a fairly new feature. I have been using it for about a month or so now, but I think it's a really cool easy way of very, very quickly disseminating information to your Jira user base so that you can give them alerts or messages or updates or whatever you want to communicate to your users. They can see it. They can't avoid it because it's going to be right there at the top. Eventually, though, they can dismiss it, but you can guarantee that somebody, hopefully, they're going to acknowledge it and see it. That's it for this video. If you did find value and I'm beating a dead horse at this point, make sure you subscribe to the channel, drop a like, share this video with your coworkers, share this video with your Jira administrators, share with the people in your life that you know use Jira and can benefit not only from this video, but from the hundreds and hundreds of videos that are available in this channel. Thank you very much and I'll see you in the next one. It's only worth it if you work for it. It's only worth it if you work for it. I won't stop till they hear me now.